What's going on, guys? Today we're reacting to Joe Rogan and Theo Vaughn's funniest moments. So, funny guy. See what he says? <laughs> I mean, I've seen the clips everywhere anyway, but... Yeah, probably. It's still fun to react to. I love him every single time, so... Yeah. I remember we went to uh, this thing called Beta Breakers a while back there. Mm -hmm. And it was like this, it was a race, I guess, where people start, I guess, at the bay, and then they run, like, the bridge or something. Yep. Well, we did a bunch of mushrooms, and we didn't, uh... Of course you did. I don't know, we weren't really in the race or anything, but at one point, we took over a a table somebody had a table where they had all the cups of water and we took it over right in the middle and i'm just just flying on mushrooms at this point dude i mean you know, i'm looking you know the lord's looking for me you know and i'm looking for him you yeah, know we're yeah. gonna meet up that afternoon but uh i'm convinced this motherfucker has lived the most eventful life ever out of anyone yeah. unless he's like faking these stories yeah but, they're, but they're, he's got so they're many. already good stories they're always good i stories, know so. that's why bro is, bro has the best life he's tried it all we, we try to get the water and we'd be like no no, it's for Asian people only. <laughs> so you had so many people, and they're running. They have to keep going. There's t there's a huge flow of people. They can't argue or discuss right, it. Right, right. You'd be like, oh, oh, it's Asians only. And they're like, <laughs> and they just keep on like, pass it out. Imagine running in a marathon, and you just see that Asian people only. And you, you just can't get water. You're like, what the fuck? <laughs> yeah, he's right. You have to keep going. Fucking young guy. A quarter mile down the road. <laughs> All these Irish people Piled stacking up. up at the curb at the next turn, just from yeah. boom. All right. the Asian people were just so happy. Super bro. hydrated. Oh, yeah, just flying. <laughs> bro, he's got this. It was just so bizarre, though. We get naked, uh huh, and they both just start cackling. Oh wow. With laughter when they see my body. Oh. <laughs> oh yo. <laughs> Can you imagine? But the whole time. Why you'd never you'd seen your body before. They've never seen my body, though. Right, but what are you laughing at? Because they're laughing at my body. Oh, okay. They're laughing so hard, it makes me want to laugh. I thought so, you were waiting your whole life to see your body, and this is when you decided to do it. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, that's not it. I had seen my body. Do I have mirrors? Yeah, but you could also not see your body if you want. Like, I'll go sometimes, you know, I remember one time that, I went like eight months oh without God. seeing my legs. I never called him dad. What the fuck do you mean? What is he even saying? <laughs> it was dark. He always looked at me like he... Like if he could, yeah. like if he could, he, was, uh -huh. he would fucking murder me, man. But you were probably ready to take him on it too, were you? No, I was terrified. Really? I tried to commit suicide. Oh. I tried to uh, OD on a bottle of Theragran M. You know those what vitamins? What is that? Vitamins. Those vitamins? Yeah, I tried to OD on vitamins. When and would you get just better? <laughs> Bro, you just got healthier? <laughs> <laughs> Wouldn't you get better? <laughs> Bro felt like, great after that. Like... I, didn't, I, didn't, I didn't have, uh, they didn't have Oxycontins back then. Oh, thank God, huh? In the podcasting world. I know she's a slut. I feel like you would have to shack at least... Shack up, Lynn. Not shack up. Jesus Christ, have some oh. respect for yourself. Who would that man... Like, who is the man? Is it a Brendan Shaw type of guy? Would, it, would you then, you think, have to gravitate towards, like, <clears throat> this, like burlesque kind of like um ambient sound of a man gun to my head because i would not date a single comic for the rest of my life and, oh, dang, and oh, that's dang. a fact <laughs> look i could get a new job <laughs> i could easily open up a bouquet shop okay i could sell bouquet man. <laughs> easily how oh, far though? You can't water a plant or anything, can you? No, I, the times that I've squirted, like I've I've squirted twice, it was more of oh. like a spill. Yeah. Ew. Oh, what the hell? Oh wow, the government's gonna have to clean this up, you know. <laughs> the government's. A lot of fucking people are gonna fucking fill out insurance claims, but it's bullshit. Someone dude. call FEMA. Like how much? Like enough to like dampen a small burger? Like enough to ruin a small. <laughs> what? Oh. Like, what? Damn yeah, it, Theo. That is exactly the right amount. Like, oh, it is, no. I would say half a juice box for. Oh! Which is enough to dampen a burger oh. for sure. Oh. What is this reaction? What a comparison. This reaction about it. In elementary school, I lived in Minnesota, and the kids used to sit, throw not snowballs at my head, but ice rocks. Oh, wow. <laughs> this guy was just abused. Yeah, th this guy is. He took like... off his clothes in front of a girl and they just laughed at him. Bro, can you imagine <laughs> that situation, though? Bro, I'd put that shit back on, I would just leave. Bro. You see, that's why we go to the gym. That's... So that we don't get laughed at when we take off that's... our clothes. That's what would humble me forever. I probably would never get naked again. Yeah. Shit wouldn't be I worth it. the hardest I can just throw it at my fucking hat. Why, you collected them or something? No, I don't. No one collects ice rocks. <laughs> oh, people being mean. People were being mean. Fuck, my bad, man. I was you like, didn't hide an icicle collection at my house? <laughs> <laughs> I'm a weird guy. 
I can and see you keep it in the freezer. People were like, hey, here's another one. <laughs> and they threw guys. it at my head. Yeah, thanks, and man. it hits my head, and I go, thanks. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, this one's shaped like Rosie O'Donnell. <laughs> no, dude. No, they used to do it violently. Oh, I'm sorry. I just want to be free also to say what I want to say. Like last night on the stage, Joey Diaz had a stage that a joke that had a bunch of racial slurs in it, right? Yeah. Ones that we would n all not even probably say on this podcast except you because you work with a lot of black people. You might be willing to drop Oh, them. I don't do the N-word. Huh? I don't do the N-word. Oh, I don't do it, dude, unless you do. <laughs> <laughs> I'll do it if you do it. I'll do yeah. it if you do it. Yeah, okay, yeah. I mean, I quit doing it probably about four years ago when everybody else did. Really? Yeah. You got off? I mean, yeah. yeah. I was like, uh, I mean, that's still like 2019. This is a little early. It's still a little, there were still snowflakes going around in 2019. I tell you, quit porn after. This train, <laughs> this train is going nowhere. Because I started going with like a therapist when I was like 23. Yeah. So Damn, you're in there, dude. I've been, I just yeah. stopped. You're like the Larry Fitzgerald of therapy, <laughs> I feel like. Yeah, man, I got dreads and shit. And we have to make urban references. You're the blackest guy we've had on the yeah, show in no, a while. Thank you. Yeah, 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 it's been a Deion while. Cole canceled, so. <laughs> man, he actually sent me. Yeah. Um, he actually was like, Neil, man, can you go over and fucking, uh, he said bless, <laughs> bless Theo, so you know he's black. Um, uh, so, uh, <laughs> I used to have those buzzer underwear, bro. They put these underwear on you. When the urine would hit them, a buzzer would go off, oh right? Oh, my God. <laughs> I'm not joking. Look them up online. This ain't no joke, bro. So I went to my grandparents. My mother didn't tell them that I had these, right? I'm really hoping these are a real thing and not just a, like a torture device your parents put on. <laughs> not at all, bro. <laughs> they made by themselves. This doctor gave them to us, dude. This dude was a bona fide. Like Google. This dude was a bona fide doctor. So we went there. I got the electric pants on, dude. <laughs> you know? <laughs> Wait, wait, what'd you like Google? Electric on what? <laughs> when urine hit the the boxers, it would like buzz for I don't know what reason. So if you pissed your pants, the parents would know. <laughs> it's just for yeah. I don't know. Wait, I cannot. This is not. real. I can't wrap my head around it. It's not real. It can't. There's no way. You know, buzzer underwear for urinators. Uh, I'll Google buzzer underwear for urinators. Um, and uh, so then, <laughs> but they didn't tell my grandfather, right? <laughs> So he fucking, and they had a small house, bro, a little bitty house. So my fucking crotch is just butt, like he he wakes up middle of the night, dude. I'm fucking. <laughs> You're on fire? <laughs> I'm not on fire, but I'm buzzing hard, bro. Because I'd had apple juice, man, and I pissed big on apple juice, dude. I fucking spray out on the AJ. So I'm in there just. What? I didn't oh know. God. And he came in. They he still got him? Yeah. Get me a pair, Lee. He didn't, he didn't that's know. what I want. Get me a pair. He didn't know I what was, was going on. Oh, my God. I'm, I'm, that's what, he comes I, in. He's scared, how bro. How loud is it? Gotta get a butt plug in. How loud is it? In a little bitty house, you could uh, you could hear from down I the hall. I just want to wake my wife up in the middle of the night, like twice a week. <laughs> I would just do two. Wait. It's not like a buzz, like a vibration. It's an actual, like, bam. It's a buzz. Oh, it's an alarm. Yeah. <laughs> he said this crap. His grandfather came down and didn't know what was going on. It's like fucking under the fire alarm. He thinks the house is on fire, I dog. To... <laughs> what the fuck is that? It's coming out his son's ass, bro. No, it's you just a buzzer me? in your underwear. You're pissing your pants. You just have this 82-year-old grandfather come down. He's like, what the fuck is going on? Actually, it would be terrifying. They he doesn't know what the fuck is going on. They just tell him kid about fucking my wife up buzzing. Up. Like, like twice a week. <laughs> I would just do two drops and you, and it goes off. And uh, and so my grandfather's in there, right? And he's all scared and shit. And uh, oh, this would have been terrible when I was a kid. And he's pushing me with a broomstick, dude. He thought I was dead. Dude. He didn't know what had happened, and we thought his heart stopped. Pushing me with a broomstick to wake me up, and he was worried because he had one of those heart makers. And uh, he was worried he would get electrocuted. He thought something was happening. He thought the house had short circuited it, or the, or the phone company had fucked up. That's what he thought the phone company had fucked up. So he thinks I'm fucking just laying there buzzing like a, a fucking miscreant. But he died, man. My grandfather ended up dying.
Bro, this is what a I, switch. Like, how is he like so funny just sitting there say, just talking like this? But then like I've never really heard of him like in movies or stand up. But he'll just do podcasts or just sit there and just be the funniest guy ever. He just fucking says the randomest shit. That like that is so funny. Like there you can't think of a story like that. Oh. I never have treated animals differently whether we're male or female. Oh. But I get I remember asking like I'll ask like a waiter like yeah is this fish male or female sometimes if I order like a sa a salmon or something. <laughs> Why? That's a good one. Just to kind of see, you know, yeah, and a lot of times fun. they'll go check. <laughs> Could check. They'll come back with an answer. <laughs> That's amazing. It's like, ugh. I guess there's no, you know what I would love in that? The fish is dead. How do they check? And sir, uh -huh. you just go wrong and get up and walk out. Yeah. Because you know they're trying to pull something off. <laughs> wrong, yeah. And open something up with a knife, just show them a part of the fish. Like, what is that? You know, That's a fish dead. Yeah. You fucking tell me that. Hide something in there. That's and the guy's it, yeah. like, Jesus. Now you know what a fish dead looks like. You thought that, you know, the sky was just gray. And then you turn on, put on, no, yeah, man, put in your, put, and then they're blue. You see colors for the, and then they'll go, oh, wow. they'll just, they'll go. No, no, no. <laughs> no. Hey, put on the glasses. No, put on the glasses. Yeah, the glasses like, you on, only yeah. see okay. black and white right now. Yeah, right? yeah. You see black, black and, and white, white right now, right? Wait, you, you be his, like, wife and, like, give it. Right, right. And here you go, here you go, um, Grandpa Phillips. Right? Yeah. 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 And then they'll do that. Yeah. And then they'll start crying. Okay. <laughs> he's too into it. Okay. I don't know what you're doing right now. I think he's acting. Yeah, yeah. Falling asleep. <laughs> you're falling, yeah, yeah. Wow, and it dude. And it happens to a lot of senior citizens. Well, no. no. Well, no, colorblind. It's fucking retard. Address somebody with a mental illness. <laughs> yeah. I say this, you fucking idiot. You fucking moron. Bro, don't make well, me take half no. of Cialis right now. All right, okay? I'm going to just say this right now, okay? Yeah. Colorblind, you're born with it. Yeah, are you? So the this has happened to a lot of senior citizens. <laughs> <laughs> you just develop colorblindness. <laughs> so their whole... You fucking moron. Listen to me right now. George laughed, dude. All right. He's from another country. He's from Idaho. <laughs> is he? Right? So they yeah, can't he see color. He said he was. He could have lied. Colorblind, they're, they have it up their whole lives. Who? Just people, people that are colorblind. Not anyone specific. Yeah. I think if people are colorblind, I think we got we got to get them more colors. All right. I think we'll wrap it up there. Give him this the color guy, reel. This guy's so funny. Oh, my Just teach him god. the shades or something. This guy is too funny. Oh, my god. I am convinced this this shit's fake. Ain't no way he's had such there's an no, eventful yeah, life. There's How old is he? 42. 40. And he's experienced. Good. I mean, 42? He could have that many stories. I Rooted mean. A lot of drugs. I mean, yeah. You know what? Half these stories probably didn't happen. He was just so cracked out on drugs. That he was like dreaming. Yeah, maybe. If you guys like the video, like, subscribe. Peace.